We told you we'd be back. You're in big trouble, mister! Welcome to another edition of WTL Wrestling Showdown, ladies and gentlemen. As you see, it's not a great day, but WTL Wrestling Showdown will make it work. And now you see Joseph Biggs and the Tormentor making their way to ringside. But let me take the time to tell you, Seven Deadly Sins is now available on the WTL box office. And following soon will be Frozen in Hell. So get your Seven Deadly Sins fixed right now on the box office. And look out for Seven Deadly Sin, I'm sorry, Frozen in Hell, which will be following very, very soon. And what an event those both were. Seven Deadly Sins did not disappoint, nor, nor did Frozen in Hell. And what a shocking turn of events that was. You tune in to find out what happened. So we do have the Tormentor and Joseph Biggs teaming today and uh, they're going to take on uh, the team of, should be on their way now, the team of the heavy artillery Rory Shaw and the returning Drew Marshall. Some interesting facts about Drew Marshall I'll tell you about but stay tuned to the end of this broadcast. I'm going to tell you where we are at the end of July, start of August. Doug Williams and who he's taking on. And here we are. Yep. Rory Shaw on the left, Drew Marshall on the right, or there, just on your screen. The last time Drew Marshall was in WTL was around 10 years ago, but has been trained on the watchful eye of W3L Hall of Famer Rowdy Ricky Knight, and we all know that name. Documentaries, films, as well as... Uh, son and daughter making waves in the wrestling world. Both teams have the advantage and disadvantage because they've never teamed before. So this will be interesting to see who has the best chemistry, who works well together. As I stated earlier on, not out the best of days, but W3L make it work and we're not going to let it stop us. And here comes Biggs and Tormenta now, attacking Marshall and Rolly Shaw from behind. Bell has sounded. Match is underway. Tormenta choking Marshall at the ropes here. Rory Shaw thrown to the outside. Double team move coming up. Oh, look at that. Marshall just broke that line and then a double close line of his own. Hey, 
And now the tormentor's out the rings, as is Biggs. Free group, free group. Right. Looks like Marshall's going to start for Shaw. No. Okay, judging by the body language, it looks like Shaw's going to start. Yep. Marshall's going to go on the apron. And it's going to be Shaw and Torment. Oh, look at that. Scoop slam. Shaw is a force you don't want to be reckoned with. Four years in the business. He's a hybrid. A mix of power, strength, speed. Shoulder blocks into the corner. Here comes Marshall now. Snap suplex, nicely done. Another tag, here comes Shaw. Has to call himself the heavy artillery. That just does exactly what it says on the tin. He is just heavy. Oh, look at that, Biggs. Knee to the back of Shaw, slowing him down. Tormentor now in control, snap mare. He's off the ropes. Basement drop kick. Lateral press, hooks the leg, gets a one. Marshall was coming in to break it, didn't need to. Biggs using the top rope to choke Shaw. Tell the referee's got to five. Breaks on four. In the corner. Look at that ring. The ring almost moved. Uh, Biggs Tormentor are doing a good job of isolating Rory Shaw from his partner from that side of the ring. Frequent tags. Now Tormentor are choking Shaw again. Tormentor are now using the referee, using Drew Marshall so that Biggs and Tormentor can have their own wicked way. There's a tag, Biggs in. The referee hasn't seen it. They're going to demolish it, but okay. Here comes Shaw fighting back. There's a tag. Biggs wants a timeout. This ain't the NFL. This ain't the NBA. Three. And the referee is continuing with that count. Now this is interesting. Shaw just tagged out. Now he's going to tag back in. I don't know how wise that is. He's still hurting. Shaw's not finished with a tournament, and here comes Biggs. Biggs is legal. Elbow. Lateral press. Gets a two. Shaw got the shoulder up. Tagging Tormenta. The team of Biggs and Tormenta are working well together. Frequent tags, as I said earlier on. 
in the corner. Four arms and chops by the Tormenta. And now choking shot over the rope. Comes a tormenta. Oh. There's an elbow. Hooks the leg. Gets a one. Look like at that. Just pushes Marshall. But all Marshall's going to do is distract the referee inadvertently for Biggs and Tormenta. Well, they get to work a double team. Biggs with a front face lock now. Swinging round. Net breaker. Biggs says you can count a hundred, but uh, she only counts to two because Shaw kicked out. And Biggs not happy. Front face lock, going for it again perhaps. Yes he is. Here we go. Wait a minute, no, Shaw. Counters into a backslide. Two. Big now. There's the tag. Marshall's in, but Biggs wants Shaw back in. So Shaw just tagged out and is tagged back in. And now here comes the Tormentor from behind. Last time it was Biggs from behind, that was Tormenta. Shoulder blocks in the corner. And a Schmidt coming in, sends shot to the other side. Here comes the Tormenta, close line. Oh, the better brushing leg sweep, fix the leg. Two only. Marshall making sure. Big now for the face lock. Trying to wear Shaw down. Marshall there trying to get behind Shaw, get these Galifans here. No, no, it's not. No, it's not. Shaw now trying to get that vertical base. Does. There's the tag, the tag's made. However, Yet the referee's not going to allow it because she never seen it. And look at Biggs taking Shaw from the apron, thrown back in, realizing shoots the half, lateral press, hooks the leg. Two only. 
Shows it a whole what all the trouble. Shaw fighting back. Look at this. Oh my god. There's the tag. It is about to be the main of the mines. There we go. Shaw coming back in now. All four men in. Referee's lost complete control. Oh, Shaw and Mash on each other. Big says one more time. And, oh, no, it didn't work this time. Sees the closing in the corner by Shaw to Marshall. And, oh, oh. And Tormenta, oh no! Super kick! Hooks a leg! He gets him! Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of this match, Drew Marshall, in the heavy artillery, Rory Shaw. Let's take a quick look. At the closing moments there. And you see Marshall in. There's the super kick. And he gets the three. Thank you, Crafty Connoisseur. Double feature. Well, ladies and gentlemen, stick with me. As we might run down the events in July and the start of August. And tell you about Doug Williams. Returning to W3L as well. Well, here you are. It's going to be Thursday, the 28th of July, Strathairn Arts Creef. Doors open 6 30. First bell is 7 pm. Tickets are on sale right now at the W3L website. Or you could chance it and get them on the door on the day, but believe me, I wouldn't chance it. Then we are Sunday, 31st of July, we're in the Elgin Town Hall for the Summer Spectacular. The first bell is at 1.30, sorry no, doors open at 1.30, first bell is 2pm. And that event will feature former TNA X Division Champion, former TNA Tag Team Champion, IWGP Tag Team Champion, Douglas Williams. That's right, Douglas Williams uh, a few years ago retired, but then decided he missed it that much, he came back out of retirement and Doug Thiel's managed to bag him. Don't miss your chance to meet Doug Williams, 31st of July in Elgin Town Hall. And then Monday the 1st of August, Macart's Gala Shields, my favourite place. Uh, we're there and uh, doors open 6.30, first bell is at 7pm for that one. And that will also be a showdown taping, so don't miss any of these events in July and August and of course as we said Doug Williams will be in action at the Summer Spectacular of the Elgin Town Hall. Now Elgin Town Hall Summer Spectacular will be a WTL box office event so the only two ways you can see this event is by being there or purchasing on the WTL box office when available. And it's also my uh, pleasure to tell you who Douglas Williams is going to face, well who better than uh, the man that's on a roll, Tier Zero, Taylor Bryden. Taylor Bryden is on an absolute roll right now, he's got momentum behind him. So what better way to test him against the uh, legend that is uh, Doug Williams. Can Doug Williams derail the train that Taylor Bryden is on right now? Or will Taylor Bryden keep the momentum going for the year that is Tier Zero? Ladies and gentlemen, I will see you at these events, but also I'll see you next Sunday for more Wrestling Showdown. Thank you for your company today. I've been Brian D, and we'll see you next Sunday.